What's up YouTube, Big Daddy here. Time for another food review. Today we're doing, Bear, your cold nose is cold on my elbow. Go away. <laughs> Today we're doing a collaboration video with Conrail Connoisseur. <laughs> guys, Connor O'Connor here. Um, if you like really good food reviews, you guys are in for a treat because this channel has a lot to offer from mukbangs, food reviews, uh, Conrad memorabilia showcasing. So definitely my channel has a lot to offer and hopefully you guys check out uh, the many videos within this channel. And we are reviewing the all new Pop-Tarts Fruit Loops. Fruit Loop flavored Pop-Tarts, and uh, they just came out about a month or two ago. They're limited edition. They look kind of cool. Fruit Loops Pop-Tarts. You want me to tell them how I real feel, really feel, mystery guest? All right, I'll tell them. You know how I really feel about these Fruit Loop Pop-Tarts? I think they're a little deceiving. You want to know why? Because on the box, do you see how it looks like it has Fruit Loops on the Pop-Tart. Well, this is what my actual Pop-Tart looks like. Okay, so here's your reality. That's the advertising. Advertising, reality. Not quite the same. Now, in times past, I have reviewed Pop-Tarts and people have complained that I never toasted them. So this time, I took someone's advice. I forgot who it was who mentioned it. Whoever you were, you know who you are. Thank you. Uh, and I left one untoasted, and I have another one that's toasted, but it's toasted and it's kind of falling apart. So it's got real toasty. So, um, but before we get into that, I just want to say a few things about Conrail Connoisseur's channel. He does food reviews. You got to go over to Conrail connoisseur and check out his channel subscribe to his channel like his videos he does all sorts of great food food review videos he does a lot of grocery items a lot of things you can find in your local walmart your target your meyer and uh, go check him out he's a real nice guy and uh, support his channel and uh, tell him big daddy sent you all right so fruit loose pop tarts Let's try the untoasted version first. Here we go, Fruitless Pop-Tarts, let's do this. So, as you can see, the Pop-Tarts have a red fruity filling. Right now, I'm tasting a lot of the pastry Not as much as the fruit, but I do taste fruit. You can see it in there. You do have a fruity, fruit loops taste. I'm pretty good. Mm. But let's try the toasted version now. So I've got a toasted one. Here it is. It kind of fell apart. It's really hot. Wow. Take apart that you can see a lot more of that filling in the middle. Mm. Definitely better toasted. It crunches up that pastry. Nice. These would go good with some milk. No, we don't have that. A nice cup of coffee. Perhaps. Mystery guest? Would you like to try some Fruit Loops Pop Tarts? No. No? Not, you're not into that? No. Not today. Alright. Hmm. Pretty good. Mm. I like it. How do you guys eat your Pop Tarts? Do you eat them toasted? Or do you eat them raw? Or do you freeze? Raw. Yeah. Untoasted, raw. 
Or do you eat them frozen? Some people like to freeze them and put them with ice cream. Have you ever done that mystery guess? That's weird, right? I never thought about it until I started reading the box. Oh, and by the way, just so you know, once again, remove from the foil before heating up. You know why they had to write that, right? Because some numb nuts put some foil pop tarts in their toaster to toast them. Put the oven, perhaps. You could also make them in the microwave, it says. Never tried that before either. I'm wondering how pop tart I wonder how pop tarts would be in the air fryer. <laughs> Ew. They might be good. Well, mmm. 370 calories. 370 calories for two pastries. That's a lot of calories. Three grams of fat. 320 grams of sodium. Who even knew there was salt in Pop Tarts? No, it's weird, right? These are pretty good, though. How do they compare calorie-wise to others that look good? Like, say, strawberry. I don't know. I really don't know. I'd have to go look, and I don't feel like going to look. <laughs> Fully baked and ready to eat. Eat or freeze or stack. I've never stacked Fruit Loops or uh, Pop Tarts either. That's weird. I wonder what they mean by stack. Like different Pop Tarts all put together, maybe? Strange. Six unique designs, it says right on the back. Six unique designs. All right, enough of this nonsense. On a scale of one to 10, I am giving the Fruit Loops Pop Tarts an 8 out of 10. I think they are pretty good. They definitely hit the mark when it comes to the Fruit Loops. They're just not my favorite thing. So I'm going to go. And they also disappointed with the picture. Right, exactly. The picture was lame. The, re the picture on the Pop Tart was not the same as the picture there. In fact, I actually thought perhaps. When you open these up, there was going to be real Fruit Loops in the frosting of the Pop Tart. Big Daddy lives in the world. <laughs> there is nothing imagination. There's Pop Tarts with frosting, and there is Fruit Loops. It could be very easy to mash the two together. You are way too old to think that that was reality. It could happen. <laughs> it could totally happen. But it did not. <laughs> hey, it could have happened, you know. You're right. There's a lot of things that could happen. All right. Well, that's an 8 out of 10 on the Fruit Loops Pop Tarts. Go over to Conrail's channel. Tell him Big Daddy sent you. Like his channel. Subscribe to his channel and like all his videos. Leave some good comments. And that's it, guys. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe, tap that notifier bell so you know when the next video comes out. And remember, before you take the first bite, you gotta stuff it in your pie hole. Fruity.